the noticing, the importance of noticing. Um, just finished the second Hunger Games book, uh, Catch Fire. And while they're in the pearls of death, they're taking time to do things that we don't even take time to do when we're not in the pearls of death. <laughs> um, but starting as um, prompts for poetry, and it was about slowing down, and I was thinking of the picture, you know, and trying to zoom into it with my screen and um, we have the affordances of doing with pictures like that and then thinking I was going to post and then I I read Kevin Hodgson's and thought for some reason that was the last one that had commented so I don't think it was intentional but was it um, I missed about five or six other comments and so rather than posting I was like really glad that I glanced back up um, so my thought was I think his question was what are you missing by not slowing down how often do I mean you can't you can't always read through all comments but how often do we not um, and then, I don't remember who posted today about storytelling and how incredible storytelling is, and then I started thinking about video and how that's how kids like to tell stories and the Hunger Games, and there are really good stories, and if we could unleash more people to tell their story, then you've got the gazillion stories, the gazillion comments. How do you get through all of that? Um, I guess the point is, not that you get through all of it. The point is that you get through enough. You stay hungry enough to always be wanting more. And back to the Hunger Games. Um, taking time to eat, taking time to, to stop in the middle of whatever and take in what's being afforded to you at that moment.